Hey, what's up everybody? How are you doing today? Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you are new here, my name is Tobias. Welcome to Microphone Mondays where I upload new microphone reviews and comparisons every Monday. And today what I have for you guys is a channel favorite. So right here I have the Mono AUPM 461TR and I will be comparing it to the Razer Siren Mini. Actually, the audio that you are hearing right now is coming from the Razer Siren Mini. I have it right here on my desk in front of me and I'm also monitoring the audio with headphones so I can hear exactly how it sounds as well. And throughout this video, I'm going to be switching between the Razer Siren Mini and the Mono AUPM461TR. And I'll go ahead and put which microphone I'm using at any given time right here in the corner of the screen so you know which microphone I'm using. These are both budget USB condenser microphones. And today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be talking about the similarities and differences between the two microphones. Then I'll do a side-by-side -side audio comparison. And then in the end, I'll let you guys know which of these two microphones I think that you would be better off going with. And right before we get into it, if you guys do decide at any point that you like this video or that this video helps you out, I'd really appreciate it if you went down there and gave this video a like. That would help me out so much. And if you would like to see more videos by me in the future, make sure to go down there and hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell notifications button. And let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, guys. So now the audio that you are listening to is coming from the Mono AUPM461TR. I have it right here in front of me on my desk. And let's go ahead and start off by taking a look at the Amazon pages for these two microphones. So first of all, the Razer Syrian Mini goes for $39.99 cents on Amazon and the Mono AUPM461TR goes for $24.90. So there is a price difference between the two microphones of $15.09. And I'll go ahead and link the Amazon pages for these two microphones down in the description of this video in case you want to check those out for yourself. And when it comes to the Razer Siren Mini, you know, it's a very basic setup. It doesn't come with much. It basically just comes with the desk stand and the microphone and the USB cable. There is a LED light on the front of the microphone. And then if we take a look at the Mono AUPM461TR, it comes with the microphone, the USB cable, just like the Razer Siren Mini. But this microphone also comes with a wind muff, which I am using right now. And then if you look at the front of the PM461TR, there is a gain knob for you to control your input volume, which I think is a very useful feature. It makes it very convenient to change your input volume on the fly. And by the way, right now I have my gain knob set to around 11 o'clock on the dial. If you look at the two microphones side by side, you'll notice that the PM461TR is quite a bit taller than the Razer Siren Mini. One other difference is that the Razer Siren Mini records with a super cardioid pickup pattern, while the Mono PM461TR just records with a regular cardioid pickup pattern. Now the difference between a regular cardioid pickup pattern and a super cardioid pickup pattern like the Razer Siren Mini uses is that a super cardioid pickup pattern is designed to be extremely directional. So basically it's designed to just pick up audio from the intended audio source and not so much anything else. So the intended benefit of that is that supposedly it'll pick up less background noise. So I think that's just about all the similarities and differences between these two microphones. Let's go ahead and jump into our side-by-side -side audio comparison. All right guys, so now I'm back on the Razer Siren Mini. I'm going to stop talking for a few seconds so we could take a listen to that noise floor. It sounds like my fish tank is getting picked up in the background. Okay, let's go ahead and switch over to the PM461TR. Okay guys, now the audio that you are listening to is coming from the PM461TR. Let's go ahead and listen to that noise floor. Okay, let's go ahead and switch back over to the Siren Mini. And now we're back at the Razer Siren Mini. This is what it sounds like when I'm tapping on my keyboard directly behind the microphone. This is what the PM461 sounds like when I'm tapping on my keyboard directly behind the microphone. Now I'm back at the Razer Siren Mini. This is what it sounds like when I'm tapping on my desk around the microphone. This is how the PM461TR sounds when I'm tapping on my desk around the microphone. 
This is how it sounds when I'm standing roughly five feet away from the Razer Sear and Mini. This is how the PM461TR sounds when I'm standing roughly five feet away from the microphone. And let's go ahead and get our final listen in to the Razer Sear and Mini for this comparison. And let's go ahead and get our final listen in to the Mono PM461TR. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to go back and listen to this audio again, and then I'll come back and I'll let you guys know what I think about it. Okay guys, so I'm back and the audio that you are hearing right now is coming from the PM461TR. And by the way, this is also my first time hearing these two microphones side by side. What I found when I went back is that each microphone kind of has one thing that's better than the other, but in my opinion, there was a clear winner in this microphone comparison, and I think that the Mono PM461TR sounded better. And let me just tell you guys why I think the PM461TR is better. So besides the obvious differences, like for example, the, it has the gain knob on the front of the microphone, besides like any of that stuff, I think that the PM461TR sounded a bit warmer than the Sirian Mini. In my opinion, the Sirian Mini sounded a bit thinner than the PM461TR, and I feel like you could kind of really notice this when I was comparing the guitar recordings. I think that the guitar got picked up a bit better with the PM461TR than it did with the Sirian Mini. And the funny thing is, is that there are a few things where I think the Sirian Mini was better at than the PM461TR. For example, I think the Sirian Mini may have had a slightly quieter noise floor than the PM461TR. Also, the PM461TR picks up way more noise when you're tapping on the desk. So if I were personally looking to buy one of these two microphones and I had to make a decision of which one I wanted to get, personally, I would definitely go with the Mono PM461TR. I preferred the way it sounded and it's actually $15 less expensive than the Siren Mini. Now, having said all that, I still think that the Siren Mini is a great microphone. I still think it's really cool. It is a bit more indiscreet than the PM461TR. You know, if you are moving around a lot on your desk and like making noise, then maybe the, the Siren Mini would be the microphone for you. But personally, I'm looking for more of the, the quality of the audio that it's picking up. So I would definitely go with the PM461TR. The Siren Mini is not a bad sounding microphone by any means, but when it comes down to it, I think I just prefer the PM461TR. But anyways, guys, I would love to hear what you guys think. Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Did you prefer the sound of the Siren Mini? Let me know down in the comments below. I would love to hear what you guys have to say. And once again, guys, I will have the Amazon pages for both of these microphones down in the description of this video in case you want to check those out for yourself. And if you did like this video or if this video helped you out, I would really appreciate it if you went down there and gave this video a like. That would help me out so much. And if you would like to see more videos by me in the future, make sure to go down there and hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell notifications button. I upload new microphone videos every Monday. I call it Microphone Mondays. If you would like to follow me on Instagram, I'll go ahead and put my handle right here. It's at YT underscore Tobias. And thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.